Hi, single cancer people. This is your Love Tarot Cards reading by Emma for the month of August 2021. The usual format, four cards representing four weeks and yeah, from there. Four of Swords and then the Seven of Swords. Two of Swords, sure. And the High Priestess. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> Three of Cups for you, Cancer, as your influencing energy, something that comes from July. I'm going to comment on it just now. Let me first pair these cards. Very interesting. Four of Swords with Six of Cups. Now, Seven of Swords with a Page of Cups. Two of Swords with Eight of Wands and the High Priestess with the Empress. Two of Swords with Three of Cups. It seems to me you do have in your environment people, you, or it's somebody that you, people that you know, maybe you do like your friend, somebody who you or with, I don't know, maybe every day you people study together, you work together, or you know each other for a very long time, you consider that you people are friends. But then you do have feelings for one of your friends, um, perhaps you are seen as a friend and you are accepted as a friend and somehow you cannot bring up your feelings. Two of Swords, definitely never, you cannot bring it up. You can't talk about it because everything is happy and jolly and you people are friends and you're having a good time and you are in love, but you cannot bring it up, you cannot say it, you cannot even admit it to yourself that you are in love with your friend or something like that really stands strongly here very specific it's going to be just for some of you but that was from from um, earlier on and look all of it let me tell you when I was drawing these cards confirms something that is again very uncomfortable and unknown you don't want to be known okay this one is laying down taking time searching for clarity now this one is going out still wanna be by himself doesn't wanna be with people there is conflicting that is unpleasant this one doesn't wanna be seen once you go away somehow quietly you see what i'm saying again something quiet again something away from away from pe from people two of so not wanting to say anything, not wanting to reveal anything of yourself, being afraid that you can't get hurt. Now, again, another number two, the High Priestess. You see what I'm saying? This is, again, being secretive, not bringing it up, not searching within, but not definitely reveal anything about yourself. All of it, the whole, the whole August. And somehow came from... Um, from July, how I many you perhaps you felt that you were in love with this person, okay, and you cannot say it, and you are hiding it, you are definitely hiding it, you are not revealing it by the end of the month. No, maybe you or by the end of the month, you will begin to search within how to uh, to to search for solution and so on, but um, not before that. Before that, look, six of cups, you are feeling love for that person. Maybe it's somebody that you know from a long time ago, as I said, it's your friend. And it could very well be that you went to school together or you know this person from some time ago, but you do feel you have a very nice feelings for this person. Beautiful feelings here. Very candid, very fine, very uh, pleasant feelings. Very lovely memories that you have with this person. I definitely felt it is about your friend, but you are very uncomfortable there. Out there, you feel very uncomfortable. You you don't even have clarity for yourself, okay? This one is laying on, the, on his stone bed. You have to find your clarity and you are very uncomfortable out there with that what you feel, with that what you recognized within yourself. You definitely not gonna bring it up. Not on the first, not this first week of August, definitely not second week of August. Second week of August though. You might actually show yourself a bit romantic, a bit sensitive, a bit emotional, like an emotional child. You see what I'm saying? You might actually begin to show your feelings. You are, as I said, this page of cups is for me very romantic young soul. 
very vulnerable that, that how you show yourself you know when you know you are in love and you begin to show gleams of that vulnerability of that uh, um, romantic feelings that you have that kind of a moment for you but still still you don't want to talk about that you are running away from people not to see you vulnerable not to see you romantic not to see you like that you don't want people to see you in that state, you, you being in love and feeling romantic. And, and you see, you feel, you feel in danger, definitely. You are in danger in here. You don't want people to see you because they will recognize that you are in love. You can't hide it anymore. So you are going away from people. You are trying not to talk, not to, um, not to speak with people. Though perhaps you are preparing yourself. You are, have, you are having these ideas in your mind how to bring it up, what to say, what to do. You are, look, you are bubbling with this eight of wands. Things are in the air for you, in your mind. You are preparing yourself how to do that, how to say, uh, where uh, or when, uh, in what place uh, should people be around or not. There's plenty. This is such intense energy with eight of wands and it is within you. You've got that intensity, how to, what to do now. You cannot bring nothing out there. You are afraid that you will be hurt. You are afraid that you are uh, um, constructing, constructing situation. How? Um, what to do? What to say? You begin to construct. Nothing out there yet. Nothing out there. End of the month. That for that's for sure. Okay. You will need still some time. This is very secretive energy of of uh, um, the high priestess. Could only, it could be that you are saying to your mother, you know, you open up to your mother, but just to that one person or that one that you trust, that is like your mother, that you believe into. You, you see what I'm saying? You will only say to that one that you know for sure will keep your secret. But still, it will be secret. It will be unknown out there in your outer world, even if you said it to one person. But that will be only one person that you trust. And you trust very much this person. Could, could be something like that with this empress and the high priestess, that kind of relationship. It doesn't need to be, you know, that age difference. You, you see what I'm saying? We are talking mother and daughter. But um, it doesn't need to be age difference or really mother and daughter. Daughter, but that feeling you are the young one you are with that innocence you are in love and you are uh, searching for advice searching to I don't know not searching for advice you just need to open up just to say it somewhere first time and from there maybe you can open up to that person and to out the world and say it but at this point, you need one so you can express it, so you can hear yourself saying it. Just like that. It doesn't matter. Maybe that person that is like your mother, person that you trust, maybe is even younger than you. You see what I'm saying? We are not talking that kind of age specifics in here, but your feeling that you are that young soul uh, uh, that is falling in love with another. Maybe, maybe that is, um, I have a really strong feeling here about maybe um, homosexual, that this person is of the same sex as you. Something is very secretive, something that you cannot open up. Or its person is um, your friend that you know from a long time ago. Something here is within you that you cannot just, that, that, um, that obstructs you of speaking, of um, bringing it up, of expressing yourself. Something is a barrier there. That, that long-term friendship, okay, that, that you think, if I now say to this person, oh, I'm in love with you, I'm going to lose friend and I'm not going to have a lover. You see what I'm saying? Could be that sort of fear that you have or you do have a fear because it is a same-sex person or something is there. That's for sure because it's everything is so hidden, so much of fear, so much of uncomfortable situation, very uncomfortable situation for you that you are running away from people not to see you, not to see what you are about, not to see that you are in love. You see what I'm saying? You are very afraid. You will open up to another, but only, as I said, only that one person. But, you know, it will be a big step forward for you, um, whatever that case is um, there.
I really hope that you're gonna enjoy it.